Andrea. I'm a senior studying course 10, which is chemical engineering. My name is Elisa Gibson. I'm a third year studying Aerial Astro. My name's Nadia Wade. I'm a junior this year. I have a course 63, which is like computer science. I'm Charles Coffey. I'm a third year bioengineering student. My name is Sienna Williams. I'm a sophomore majoring in aerospace engineering. We're just out here for a hike, which is like really nice. I get a little restless <laughs> staying on campus and doing virtual classes. So it's always nice to get out and get into nature. Yeah, I feel like I'm a lot more intentional about getting off campus. Before COVID, you could kind of find things to do around campus, so you didn't really feel like you had to leave. But now I feel like I'm branching out a little bit more. Which is good. A lot of these people I haven't seen in a year, a year and a half. And so, just taking a walk with them, you know, breathing air, talking to people, the diversity of, of thought, experience, and perspective, I just appreciate it so much. You can't take it for granted. I really love the earth, I love nature, it just makes me feel really happy. I actually was in quarantine for like the past week, and so now that I am free, I've been taking every opportunity I can to go outside. We've been going on quite a few hikes. I made a list of places that I wanted to go in the New England. I'm like slowly chipping away at that list. <laughs> I've recently been reading The Overstory, which is really good. They like love nature so much. And the way he talks about how trees and organisms have a different kind of intelligence and that should be valued just as equally as our own intelligence and our own development speaks a lot to me. I think our main goal should be to just take care of the earth the best we can. So I want to go to space eventually, and so when I come back, I want the earth to be nice for me and my children. I've been inspired to learn more about biosystems and how we can use them to better ourselves, better the planet. It's beautiful. <laughs> so hopefully we keep it looking this way. 